Kimberly K. Reynolds is an American politician serving as the 43rd and current governor of Iowa. Since 2017, she is a member of the Republican Party. Reynolds previously served as the 46th Lieutenant Governor of Iowa from 2011 to 2017. Before she was elected Lieutenant Governor, Reynolds served as Clark County Treasurer for four terms and then served in the Iowa Senate from 2009 to 2010. Reynolds became Governor of Iowa in May 2017 when her predecessor, Terry Brastard, stepped down to become United States Ambassador to China. She won a full term as governor in the 2018 gubernatorial election. Reynolds was born Kimberly K. Strawn in St. Charles, Iowa. She attended high school at the Interstate 35 Community School District and graduated in 1977. Strawn attended Northwest Missouri State University for one semester where she took classes in business, consumer sciences and clothing sales and design. She dropped out of college after one semester. She later took classes at Southeastern Community College in the late 1980s and then took accounting classes at Southwestern Community College between 1992 and 1995. She left both of these institutions. Reynolds began partially online classes at Iowa State University in 2012 and received a Bachelor of Liberal Studies degree in December 2016. Reynolds was twice charged with driving under the influence of alcohol, first in 1999 and again in August 2000. In 2000, she was initially charged with an aggravated misdemeanor, but pleaded guilty to a lesser offense. In 2017, Reynolds stated that she sought inpatient treatment for alcoholism following her second arrest and that she had been sober for nearly 17 years. Reynolds married Kevin Reynolds in 1982. As of 2018, the Reynoldsers have three daughters and nine grandchildren. Reynolds served four terms as the Clark County Treasurer before being elected as a Republican on November 4, 2008 to represent the 48th District in the Iowa Senate, defeating Democratic candidate Ruth Smith and Independent candidate Rodney Schmidt. In 2010, Reynolds endorsed a ban on same-sex marriage in Iowa. On June 25, 2010, Republican gubernatorial nominee Terry Brastard publicly proposed Reynolds to be his running mate as the lieutenant governor candidate. The next day, she received the Republican nomination from the 2010 Republican State Convention. On November 2, 2010, the Brastard Reynold ticket won the general election. Reynolds resigned from her Senate seat on November 12, 2010, ahead of taking office as lieutenant governor. Reynolds was sworn in on January 14, 2011. Reynolds co-chaired the Governor's Science, Technology, Engineering and Math Advisory Council, Iowa Partnership for Economic Progress Board, and the Military Children Education Coalition and was also Brasted's representative on the board of the Iowa State Fair. Reynolds was elected chair of the National Lieutenant Governors Association in July 2015. On May 24, 2017, Reynolds became governor of Iowa upon the resignation of Governor Terry Brastard, who stepped down to become the new United States ambassador to China. Reynolds is the first female governor of Iowa. Reynolds' elevation to the governorship created a vacancy in the office of the lieutenant governor, and reports indicated that her selection of a lieutenant governor could be challenged in the Iowa Supreme Court. An opinion from the Iowa Attorney General indicated that an individual promoted from lieutenant governor to governor, as was Reynolds, not have the authority to appoint a new lieutenant governor. On May 25, 2017, Reynolds announced that Iowa Public Defender Adam Gregg would serve as acting lieutenant governor. To avoid litigation, the Reynolds administration stated that Gregg not hold the official position of lieutenant governor, and would not succeed Reynolds in the event of her inability to serve as governor. In 2018, Reynolds proposed cutting $10 million from the Medicaid program which cares for eligible low-income adults, children, pregnant women, elderly adults and people with disabilities. In 2020, Reynolds proposed a one-cent increase in the state sales tax, offset by a phrased reduction in the state income tax, including a cut in the tax rate for the top income bracket from 9% to 5.5%.
Reynold proposed restructuring of the state tax code would represent a further reduction in income taxes. Going beyond 2018 legislation that was the largest income tax cut in Iowa history. Her proposed sales tax increase, however, was largely opposed by state legislators. In 2018, following the U.S. Supreme Court's decision in Obergefell v. Hodges, Reynolds described same-sex marriage as a settled issue and said that she did not consider herself obligated to follow the Iowa Republican Party platform provision against same-sex marriage. Reynolds is a staunch supporter of Donald Trump. Reynolds blocked two-thirds of requests from Democratic State Attorney General Tom Miller to join multi-state lawsuits challenging